In the Himalaya, people have traditionally relied on springs and tapping subsurface water into nalas or bodies as their primary source of drinking water. Over the years, severe environmental degradation has led to poor recharge or complete drying up of their primary water sources. Dr. Tim Rees, a geohydrologist, designed the infiltration well, which is a classic extension of the traditional nala system. The traditional nala is a stone structure with a roof. Typically about 4 to 5 feet deep, this intercepts shallow subsurface water capillaries. The infiltration well is about 25 to 30 feet deep and taps deeper water capillaries. This makes more water available to the community. A well made of semi-porous concrete blocks intercepts these capillaries after they pass through a sand filter. The structure is completely covered and a hand pump is used to draw water from the well. They contribute a minimum of 10% of the cost by collecting funds among themselves or by contributing towards the labor costs. This helps in creating a sense of ownership and responsibility towards their water sources. The operation and maintenance is done by a team elected by the villagers themselves. They collect funds by levying a monthly charge for water and this has been adequate for meeting all their running costs. In order to spread the benefits of this technology to other mountain regions, it was essential to build on the skills of local youth. This led to the formation of the Kumau Artisans Guild, which is now a dedicated body of over 50 barefoot engineers. So far, over 300 infiltration wells have been constructed in nine districts of Uttarakhand and Himachal Pradesh, and about 50,000 people now have access to clean, portable water using this technology. These are but small steps towards creating a platform within the river basin, upon which communities and all stakeholders jointly act for the renewal of the hydrology.